<clears throat> um, yeah. I'm hold on. I'm really disappointed because let me tell you what happened. Sometimes with this recording software, it doesn't record the audio. I had that happen to me a couple of times now. So whenever I put in I plug in this microphone right here, it has this cord. Whenever I plug it in, I make a slight test where I make some noises and see if the program registers that. And I did that. But for some reason during the game something some technical difficulties must have happened which mean that I don't have the audio from my live recording. Now obviously I'm recording this with my cell phone, my cell phone has a mic. But that mic is horrible and I wouldn't wa would not want you to have to go through that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to redo the tip that I did that I showed you which is how to basically set up the best splits in the game, in my opinion. Because you're only sending four people and it comes in really consistently. And then I'm going to do a post comp of the actual game, which was against the nine ranked player. I'm really happy that I, I was thinking that I had that on live comp. I had, but I forgot to record the audio, so that's just really annoying. So we're gonna fight through it and push through it and yeah. Just do our best to forget that because this is this annoys me a lot. Because that would be, that, that, that was good content. Okay. Yeah, we're in the Green Bay Packers defense, and this is a play that we're gonna come out in. Or the formation that we're kind of gonna come out in. Big time over six. One of the most powerful formations in the game this year. We wanna make sure that we have the audibles cover to sync and cover three sky. We wanna come out, oops. In DV sync to bus. Also, these audibles to sync and cover three sky. They're these dark ones, okay? So you shouldn't have to check that. Now, depending on where the halfback is, in this case, he's on the left, we wanna audible to cover to sync. Then we want to uh, press, move him in, QB contain, go on this linebacker right here, move him back a step, then click off, that moves him back right there, and man him up on a running back. Now, this split should get in. Not against seven people in anymore. The I'm currently out in a player that sends um, five routes out against five routes against a non blocked running back. It's going to get uh, come in all, all the time. Against Six people blocked is also gonna come in and I'm going to show this to you now. I'm gonna snap the ball and you see how he just goes right by the running back. If your opponent blocks seven people, he does not come in or he shouldn't come in. I haven't got that to work gotten that to work in practice mode. Sometimes online I've noticed that it that it works. I've been running this defense for quite some time now. And it sometimes works. In practice mode I haven't found a way to, for it to work. So I'm going to run this play now. And everybody should get picked up. Now, see right there, he didn't. That's really weird to me. I don't understand it. That's really weird. But just know that it can get picked up if your opponent blocks seven. Now, if the offense comes out like this, then we want, with the running back on the right side, then we want to audible to cover three because then the DB is blitzing from the right side. Then the same adjustment blitz, keep him in right there, move this guy back a step, then man him up. And now this should wrong controller and then they should also get in we'll see sometimes it's it can be a bit inconsistent in practice mode but online it works really well get somebody with high speed there and he's just gonna absolutely eat now right there is on the left again so we're going to do the setup press move him back then man him up on the running back and you see how we just get in cleanly boom just like that that's the tip that i was talking about now let's get into the game against a 9 ranked player. And once again, I'm sorry guys. I tried to do my best to, to avoid it. It didn't work. And yeah, also I'm going to be using the splits in this game. So yeah, you can also learn how to use it. Thank you. And sorry. Um, yeah, so with that said, we actually get into a game. We actually don't because this stupid glitch. If you guys know, play on PlayStation, you know the stupid glitch where it sometimes tells you that the game... Did not properly match up, and then you get have to restart that. And yeah, 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 it's it's annoying. And I look at this game attack. I mean, its team is decent, but look at this game attack. This is the number nine ranked player in all of seasons. And despite knowing that I wasn't really that scared, I got outside outside the pocket there. And yeah, <clears throat> did what I could. He's running the same defense that I broke down to you guys, but he's running it with some little wrinkles that I didn't want to explain uh, in that much detail. And he's also rushing his users, so that's really annoying. Right there, I get the pass off. 
So at, at that moment, I decided if I cannot block the blitz, then I have to send out five rods. Now, right there, I max protected, had seven people protecting, and said, okay, I think I can block the blitz now. If not, then I'll just punt. I was able to fit in the corner rod. Now, right there, I hit a quick hitter, not trying to give him a chance to come, sack me, and right there, I was just me being an idiot. I have streak specialist on Calvin. Usually, he catches those but he was double covered because he was manned up it was a stupid read and i got punished for it that's how it should be now right there speaking of stupid read yeah what's that i mean that's a pick he's throwing it straight at his own straight up straight at my user that's double covered <laughs> and we don't really accept it apparently now right there fourth fourth and 23 he takes his losses and punts the ball back to me because he knows that his defense is pretty good. It seems like it's really annoying. He's not used to rushing me anymore. He seems to figure out that that's not working for him. And he's tried something else now right there. Third and 16. History Davian Clowney just straight up bullied my uh, left tackle Munoz. Even though he's the highest uh, O-line man I have, he got absolutely destroyed. And that's not fun. But there is hot. he's got this strange strong wing scheme. And he's trying to pass the ball out of. And yeah, it's just not working for him. And right there, he moves a fullback. And this is actually a good play. You notice that I had a, cl a cloud flat on the left side. Not on the right side, though. And he read that. And good play. I did not think that he would run an out route to his fullback. But yeah, he did. And got the first down. But right there, we're screaming at him. Back to back plays. Right there, he had the corner out open for a step. But Fitzpatrick would have caught up, caught up to him. And would have made the play, I think. I'm very confident about that. Now, right here, he punts the ball back to me. Because he knows that his defense is tough. And I know that, and so that I, ho I hope to get something going on special teams. Not quite as much as I wanted to. Maybe he should have spun right there or something. That was a really smart play by him. He sent the guy that was defending the in route even before I had stepped up in the pocket. Good play by him. Can't say nothing else. Right there, sending six people. Can't block the blitz in that case because I sent out too many routes. What are you going to do? Sometimes the blitz is going to come in. You got to deal with that, and you got to punt the ball away and be smart. Now right here, I'm thinking just enough time to make a mistake. That's sack number one. Boom, call that timeout, will ya? I did call a timeout, and here's sack number two. Call that timeout. He's trying to pass the ball out of gun bunch. Uh, crossing route and slant route. Easy, easy, easy to cover. Now right there, I get held up by my own guy, so I couldn't make what I wanted to. But I'm thinking I just got to get 12 yards, and I'll be in field goal range. Whoop, swerving a little bit. And we're in field goal range. I'm huddling up, uh, huddling up, uh, hu uh, hurrying it up, no huddle, and get absolutely popped by Sean T. I'm just trying to get a little bit more closer. I even spiked the ball, and what is that? That's Saquon Barkley, and he gets hit, he gets sneezed at by Taylor Mays without enforcer, note, note that, and fumbles the ball. But you know how I mean this man giveth and man taketh. In that case, man took it and yeah we're taking it back for six that's Taylor Mason if you if the live car would have worked you would have seen me absolutely go crazy because I love it when my Taylor Mace forces fumbles I get really animated like that makes me so happy seeing that so right there that would have been a funny clip but what can I say now we're up 10 to 0 and I'm feeling really conf confident because he's got this gun bunch scheme and I know how to run gun bunch I know what he's gonna look to do and I know that I can defend what he's trying to do just containing making sure that he can get outside of the pocket and then just use it his so far only run the crossing route with the slant uh, so I receive a post so I'm not he hasn't shown me anything that I need to be afraid of necessarily not right there that was a really poor user I thought that he would move on to the slant because I kind of like baited back to the po uh, crossing route. I thought the pressure was going to come in. It absolutely did not. Sit down, Barkley. That's what I love. I love those animations where he just gets absolutely destroyed. Now, right there, why is that not a pick? Yeah, I mean, I spoiled it, but I spoiled it, but you guys know that you don't catch an reception in this, in this game. Really annoying. Right there, very smart play by him. I moved the... Well, I took the flat off the field to get a hook curl in there, but he converts on 4th and 3. So he's making relatively good reads, but he hasn't shown me anything I need to be, be, be very about. Uh, not even now. Right there, got a hook curl, placed that slant beautifully. Third and ten, I believe. 
why I say believe is because it's a bit, it's a bit lower quality on my screen. And you guys absolutely scream that. Yeah, no chance for him. Right there, that was really dumb by me. I thought that I could have fumbled there if I went, kept going straight. Thankfully, I didn't. But if I had, uh, had continued, that would have been trouble. Now, right there, I'm kicking my field goal. I'm up 13 to zero. It's already end of the third quarter. It took some good time with me, and he did it uh, himself as well. So he threw in the towel. Yeah, he wasn't all that. I think I played really well. And if you don't believe me by now that my the things that I'm telling you guys are good, then I don't know what you're doing. Maybe you should buy some evil code or whatever. The stuff that I'm showing is good. I just beat the 9 ranked player in the world. It's completely free. If you don't subscribe, it's your own fault. But I mean, it's a free world or whatever. At least if you're living in Western civilization, it's a free world. Anyways, no, no politics, please. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. Like you said, subscribe if you want to see the best tips on YouTube. I'm out. Peace.